Welcome back everyone. I'll go and show you exactly how to use a VPN on any iPhone out there. Now there are a couple of different ways to do this. Okay. There's not just one way to do this, but if you want to use an application, I would probably recommend doing it that way. However, the first way to do this is via your settings. So what you can do is you can go under your iPhone settings right here, and you can also just type in search up here and you want to just type in a VPN and you just want to type in a VPN. So you can see there's a VPN setting under general VPN. Now I would recommend typing it in because on different iPhones, it may have a different way of looking at it and it may be updated in the future. So you wanna go ahead and go there and you'll be able to see that there's a little VPN option right here, VPN and device management. All you wanna do is go ahead and click on VPN and device management under your general settings. And what you'll be able to do is you can sign into a different VPN if you want. So you can click on VPN and only if you actually do have a VPN configuration, like the manual configurations, you want to go ahead and input them here. Now, a majority of you may not have this, so that's why the secondary option there with an application is. But if you do have your custom VPN, you know, all these numbers and everything, then this is how you typically do it for the most part. Now, let's say you don't have that and you want to use an application or this doesn't look familiar to you at all. Well, what you can do here is you can download an application, a VPN app through your app store. So what we can do is we can go and click on the app store right here. We can go and click at the search button down here click up here and you just want to type in a VPN. Now, if you have the name of the VPN that you use, then go ahead and use it there. However, if you don't, you can just type in VPN like this, or you can type in like best VPNs on Reddit or something like that, or YouTube. And you just want to go ahead and see which VPN strikes you the best. Now, some of these you have to pay for, so keep that in mind. Other ones are free kind of. So in this case, all you have to do is just find the one that works for you. In this case, we will literally just download the first one that pops up. So we'll go ahead and use this one, which I've talked about before. And once it's done downloading, all you have to do is go ahead and open up this application. And what'll happen is it'll go ahead and tell you to do whatever. So Sometimes they tell you to sign up for something. You can just click the X button and then pretty much hop out of it. Now at this point, what you can do is you can just click the connect button right here. And most of the time you may get this pop-up. You just want to click allow. And what's going to happen is it's going to go ahead and connect. And this, sometimes there's this little, you know, ad that comes up, but you should see a little VPN thing that came up right there. And that means you are connected. You can also, and if you swipe down to your control center, you should be able to see a little VPN option right there. That actually means you are connected to a VPN and you're pretty much good to go. Now, if at any point you want to delete your VPN, or you want to go out of it, all you have to do is go back into that application. And at this point, you just want to click the disconnect button. Okay, disconnect. And now you will start to see that your VPN option will not be there and you are now disconnected from your VPN. So that's pretty much how to do it. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.